My question is to the Minister representing the Minister for Agriculture, Fisheries and Forestry, Minister McCarthy. The Danish Government has introduced mandates to use Bavaria 10 to reduce methane production in its dairy industry to meet climate targets. Is Labor considering similar measures for dairy and livestock in Australia? Thank you, Senator Whitten. Uh, Senator McCarthy. Uh, thank you, President. Thank you, Senator, for the question. Uh, the answer is no, but we are uh, introducing methane uh, as additives. Thank you, Minister. <coughs> Senator Whitten, first supplementary. Uh, Bavaria 10 is already in use in Australia, with some of our major retailers sourcing meat grown with the additive. There is no requirement to label milk or meat as containing Bavaria 10, limiting customers' ability to choose. Does Labor believe that Australians' right to know what is in their food is secondary to the perceived climate impacts of cow burps? Uh, thank you, Senator Whitten. Minister McCarthy. Uh, thank you, President. Well, uh, can I just put on the record for the Senate that uh, this government always uh, wants Australians to know uh, about most things, Senator? So I, I would certainly object to the, to the uh, introduction of your question there. Uh, but we are certainly, uh, well, no, that's not quite true, but anyway, uh, supporting introduction of methane and reducing additives, as I've said. Yep. Uh, thank you, Minister. Senator Whitten, second supplementary. Since the introduction of Bavaria 10 mandates in Denmark, starting 1 October 25, there have been increased reports of cattle becoming sick, collapsing and, in some cases, being euthanised. Are Australians at risk from these additives in their food? Thank you, Senator Whitten. Minister McCarthy. Uh, Senator, I, I, sorry, President. Senator, do I, I do believe I've, I've answered the questions, but I'm happy to take some more on notice in terms of any uh, particular examples that you may have uh, for the minister. 